With Solo Leveling Arise releasing soon, I wanted to check out how the gameplay looked. So today we're going to be live reacting to 37 minutes of gameplay from PS360 HD2. Uh, also, check him out, follow, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Subscribe to me for more content on Solo Leveling Arise. I will be doing a lot of streams, gameplay, all that fun stuff that you're not going to want to miss. And let's hop in right now. Also, let me know in the comment section down below. What is your favorite character in solo leveling? And, uh, you know, for me personally, currently, it's just, it's just Jin Wu here. He, he's so awesome. He's so awesome. But hopefully that changes in the future, man. I'm going to see some spoilers because I'm not fully caught up on the series, but I don't care. This looks epic. Epic. Ep epic. I can't even talk. So this gameplay, by the way, is from like like a year ago or so i'm sure that it is much better looking now than it was in this time much more polished smoother all that fun stuff all right so let's see what we have Hot don't play oh look at the overworld there i don't know this character but he looks kind of cool i'm really excited about playing this game on mobile and pc though that's gonna be really cool i think I love how a lot of open world mobile games are now coming out with like, you know, that cross play compatibility between those or even some are coming out with like PlayStation and stuff like that. Okay. Oh, Jinwoo, let's see what he can do, man. That's cool. That's the graphics are insane, man. The graphics are insane. Look at the boss fight there. So right now it's more of a trailer. We got to see more of the gameplay in a minute. Ooh, I like that block there. That was kind of cool. I love the effects too on the attacks. It's all shining, lightning, all that fun stuff. Really cool. Look at the sky right there. Oh, the eyes. <laughs> Ooh. So I saw something about like Jin. I'm not caught up. I saw something about him like being uh, a summoner or something like that for undeads or something like that. Correct me if I'm mistaken. I am currently reading it. I'm just not uh, not fully caught up. Okay, so let's see what we have in this one. I think these are still more like trailers in the front, but there is actual literal gameplay in here. Oh, they're talking about the emotes here. So let's see what we have. We have the time attack mode. Oof. Okay, time attack mode. Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> that was really cool. It's crazy seeing all the spells and skills and stuff that he has here in relation to where the anime currently is, by the way. Like I like I said, I started reading it, but I'm not nowhere near this. Okay, it looks like you have party change mode. Or character change in a party, something like that. Okay, there's a ranking system based on your clear time. That's normal. Pretty standard stuff. Okay, ooh, look at the perfect dodges. I love it. I like how, oh yeah, quick time events pop in. Okay. I like how when he's doing those dodges, it's kind of slowing down around him. That's pretty cool. Air bonus is there, air combat with the quick time event. That's kind of cool though. I like that. Yeah. And victory there. All right, let's see what else they have here. That was kind of cool. Still another trailer, but showing more stuff. Okay, here's some gameplay for real now. Okay. Okay, so I want to kind of like see what they had on the screen there. Because they were showing like some menu or something. Let's see what, if we can kind of decide what that is. Uh, It looks like they maybe. Are they reviewing skills? Is this like a skill level up system? It definitely is a skills page. It's got the Q and E there. It's definitely a skills page. Oh uh, my God, he's got a crap ton of skills. <laughs> Maybe he's like selecting different ones to equip or something like that. Uh, looks like another progression system here, potentially. Or skill selector, potentially. Okay, okay. Yeah, this game seems already like it's gonna be pretty in depth. A lot of these like anime games or whatever pop out, you know, and, and they don't anime games, you know, things like that. They don't really pop out and have 
a lot of depth to them, but this one seems like it's handled with care. I don't love Netmarble as a publisher, personally, but I can't deny that they do a good job on their games for the most part. I think some of their older games were kind of whatever, like, what was it, like, King's Raid or whatever, King's Chronicle, something like that, Knight's Chronicle, whatever it was, I had tried it, and it was super pay to win when I tried it, like, years ago. Uh, look at that keyboard layout, okay. But uh, I, I can't deny that they're doing, uh, you know, they're doing better. Okay, it looks like the standard layout, though. You know, spacebar, WASD, QER, you know, all that stuff. So, pretty standard. One, two, three, four. With the mouse, obviously. Obviously. Oh, a dungeon here. Spoilers! I don't know these characters yet! <laughs> I saw some stuff about like where they were comparing the webtoon as well to this and it's kind of cool. Where they were like comparing like the webtoon or whatever to the no no the the the, the I don't I don't think it was the webtoon it was like the the manhwa or something like that to the animations in game and uh, it was like a side by side comparison that was really cool to see. Okay. This boss guy, we're about to kick his ass! He looks really cool, though. Ooh, okay. So it looks more or less like a standard game here. I'm really curious about whether you could actually change your your party member that you're playing with, or do you just call them to do skills? Like for example, in One Punch Man World, you just tell them to use their, not even like, you don't even really tell them to use their skills. In fact, you just use whatever like is equipped to them as an item type deal. Nice parry there, okay, that was kind of clean. The boss is crazy, huge, and I love the fire effects and stuff when he swings. That's really cool. And Jin Woo's combo chain is awesome. The air combat, everything. When he was standing there, his swords were on his back there for a moment too. That was kind of cool. The smaller swords, like the level of detail. Well, I'm like, there it is. I'm seeing with Jin Woo is awesome. Are you guys excited about this game? Leave it in the comments. Ooh, I love the little purple flash when you get a perfect vantage there. I, that's some Dragon Ball Legends, you know, verbiage, but you get the point. Ooh, 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 get him! <laughs> oh, that was a hella clean finish, too. Oh, he went zigzag, zigzag, damn! That was clean, man. Ooh. I just got a notification saying that my emoticon called PogChamp has been approved on Twitch. <laughs> if you guys aren't already following me on Twitch, be sure to. Link is down below in the description. Because uh, I will... There will be times where I stream on both platforms, but there may be longer streams or more of that kind of on Twitch exclusively uh, and where it winds up just getting cut down into a YouTube video. You know the you know the drill. You know how, how that kind of goes. I'm sure you've seen that with like other... You know, creators and stuff. So that's probably what I'm going to wind up doing. Okay. Getting absolutely wrecked, boy. Damn, okay. Ooh! Hey! Hey, look at the ultimate skill there. Oh, that was clean. Oh, that was sexy, baby. Oh, 
Oh, this all this is doing is making me want to read more. I just want to read more now. Oh my god, bro. Get out of range. Oh, you got stunned. He got stunned. Damn, that's brutal. Oh, oh, oh. So is the is the green circle the is a healing circle or something like that? By the way, I've noticed already that you are not switching or anything like that. You are just kind of uh wait, why am I hearing my voice? Hold on. <laughs> hold on. My bad, hold on. I heard my voice. It started playing one of my streams in the background or something. Stop it! Nobody asked you to play! Okay, I fixed it, I think. I was going to say, I noticed that you aren't switching. You're just having them do the skills. And I was going to say if the green circle was a healing circle from um, Juhi, which I'm pretty sure it was. So, okay. I kind of got my own question answered in there. So, it's cool. My bad. I had to turn the audio off for a second because I started hearing myself. You guys probably heard that too. I had a, a download going on in the background. I guess it started auto-playing one of my videos. All right. So we did a stream earlier today on TikTok. Uh, ooh, maybe I'll stream this game on TikTok too. Follow on TikTok. I think I, I think I'll stream on TikTok too. I think that'll be fun. It actually works better to stream this on TikTok because I can just do it straight from my tablet without having to set up anything. So we're looking at equipment here. Um, looks like he's got a couple different uh, equipment stops, slots. Party select screen. Okay. I know barely any of these characters. That chick with the blonde is the one I was introduced in episode eight of the anime, right? I haven't got there yet with my with my book. I should I could have skipped over the first volume, but I because I had already seen the anime and I'm pretty sure it's like mostly similar. But I decided to still read it, so it's kind of slowing me down, obviously. Okay. It's gonna run it again, huh? So was this the time attack event? I think that's that's what they're saying here. Ooh. Oh my god, bro. This looks amazing. Let's see if we can get some other footage in here. Yeah, that was a healing circle. Is there another fight or anything to see? Looks like they're mainly showing the same stuff. I mean, it's a little bit different. It looks like with the heal, you heal a flat amount at the front, and then you heal every couple seconds you're in the circle. But he keeps getting stunned. <laughs> Dude, look at the mobility on the boss. He just teleported back there. That's crazy. Get out of range! Stop trying to block it. Get out of the range! Oh, dodge it! <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, baby, he's out of range. There you go. No, leave it! <laughs> I'm sure they're telling him the same damn thing. <laughs> heal, heal. Ah, uh, you stay there too long. Yeah, that long range attack is pretty clean, though. He's at five minutes fighting this guy, so. He's not going to rank very highly if this is the time attack mode. <laughs> he's not going to rank very highly at all. It actually, by the way, I'm sure this game will have some sort of like co op or something like that. Dude, tell me why I almost pressed my mouse to try to like change the camera angle. Looks like he lost. Okay. Uh, I'm sure this game will have some sort of like co-op or something. But it does look like you don't really have anybody else on the board with you either. It's just a 1v however many enemies. Like it's not like, like for example, going back to One Punch Man. While you can't control your allies, they are at least on the board with you. And this one, at least, at least for the time attack mode, if that's what this is, that's the case. I'm sure that, like I said earlier, it's more polished, but I'm sure that they've also published more footage of the game beside this video since since then, as we are getting closer to the official release of the game anyway. Ooh, okay. Looks like they got it. They got it that time. Okay. 
What did he do? Do the summons? Yeah, he's using everyone's skills right there. Oh, okay, okay. I see what's happening. Those come out really fast. Those those fire slashes or whatever come out really fast. Dude, his range is crazy. The boss would just decide in any moment that he wants to freaking just blow up everything on the freaking map. Look at that humongous ass fireball! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, and the boss is stunned after that. That's cool. That's how he's going to win here. Okay. Yeah, he's going to get it. Oh, no. Don't win. You're a loser. Don't win. He's stunned again. Nice. Okay. Well, let's see if there was any other. Looks like it's mainly just skill stuff. He, he... It makes sense, though. This was like some really early on footage. I believe from a convention or something like that. So they didn't really have a ton to really show anyway. They kind of just play the same content over. So all in all, I thought that this looked amazing and I am excited as all hell to see how this looks now with modern stuff. I think this is gonna be super duper cool with the modern stuff and, and, and the way that it's changed because this footage was probably recorded in 2021 or something like that. The video was uploaded a year ago. Uh, November 2022, so just almost a year and a half ago. I I don't know if it was exactly from literally then. Maybe it was a little bit older footage. I'm not sure. But nonetheless, this looks amazing. Be sure to subscribe. Like I said, follow on TikTok, on Twitch as well, because I will be streaming on both platforms, and we're going to be going really hard on solo leveling. In fact, if you follow my other channels, they're going to be not really on the back burner, but I'm not going to have as much content coming out for those channels for probably a couple of weeks or maybe maybe a week. Uh, because this is only the soft, soft beta. It's not really going to be like a launch or anything. So, all right, guys, I'll see you all next time.